Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvanian toy collector, and it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we got a bunch of figures to review. First is some Pokemon items, and this counts as Anime Week on this channel. And we got one new item with Loyal Subjects. My Hero Academia boxed All Might. It's All Might, people. The symbol of peace, the symbol of strength. Before we show off the new figure, we're going to look at each thing from the Pokemon pile up here. First, I got another Pikachu. Pikachu. Because I just love Pikachu. He's been my favorite Pokemon since my childhood. And I'm so glad to add another Pikachu to my collection. And that's all he does. He doesn't have any articulation except for uh, in the ears. Which is nice. All there is to say for Pikachu. Next we got a Pokeball. And it's an empty Pokeball. There's nothing in it. But it's a different Pokeball I don't have. If you know this particular Pokeball, leave me a comment. Because I don't know many Pokeballs. I really don't. Except for the originals. And speaking of originals, we got another original. That's nice. And another original. I threw my Pikachu Spin Topper in there so he could be displayed in the Pokeball. Like he's coming out of the Pokeball. That's probably just how I'm going to display him. Because he doesn't stand on his own very well. And that's all there is to say for that Pokemon item. Next on the list we got a Pokemon belt of sorts. I really don't know much about this. But given it was Pokemon related. And I love Pokemon. That's why I picked it up. If you know this particular item. And where what it goes to leave me a comment because I do not know but I am going to show this off it won't fit on me I could probably display it on a plush or something like look I can have Pikachu wearing the belt if I wanted to if I wanted to now he's got a Pikachu uh, little champion belt thing and he could be like I'm the best Pika Pika and that's all there is to say for that Pokemon thing and now it's time for the new item here on Eddie Hill Review and we're gonna do that right now as soon as I put away the Pokemon stuff on my shelf near my review station Yep. Near my review station, I'm just that clever with putting stuff in places. Huh. I wanna be the biggest, no one Sorry, I couldn't help it, because it's I was putting away this stuff, and I can't help but sing sometimes. But now we're going to look at Loyal Subjects All Might. But first, we're going to look at the packaging. It's the same box artwork for the UA High School, and the same on the other boxes with the figures I don't have. I've got Todoroki. I've got... I don't have Ingenium or this All Might, or not All Might, but Midoriya. Sorry if I had to correct myself, and I don't have Bakugo yet. I don't have the Long Ton Sue yet. I don't have this Midoriya or the Golden version, which is Golden Edition one. I, I really don't. I do have these three now. But I don't have Ida without his helmet. And that's all there is to say for the packaging. 
Let's look at the figure itself. And this is a good looking little representation of All Might, the symbol of peace himself. And I dig this figure. He is worth eight dollars. I picked him up for eight dollars. And he is worth adding to my ever growing My Hero Academia collection. Now we're going to look at the collector card All Might, Hero, Quirk, all for one. And his bio, if you wish to read it. It's nice, we get a bio card. And a card that shows off all the other figures there are to collect. And there's quite a few, and I don't even have all of them yet. That's all there is to say for the collector's card. Now we're going to get down to comparison, but before that, articulation. He can kick back that far, but given... These joints are really fragile. You don't want to bend them too far back or you risk breaking your figure. No elbow articulation. Arms are on a hinge, which is nice. But not much articulation in the arms. Head is on a rotation joint and a ball joint, but it's a hard ball joint. Now for comparison... Here is Loyal Subjects All Might next to All Might himself. They share the same grin as one another, but this one is bigger, this one is smaller. All there is to say for that. Now for comparisons with some other Loyal Subjects figures. Sue next to All Might. Uraraka from Loyal Subjects next to All Might. And Loyal Subjects Todoroki next to All Might. And these are the Class 1A students I have so far. From Loyal Subjects. This is a really good line for figures that you can get for about 10 bucks. I highly recommend these figures to anyone who's a big fan of My Hero Academia like I am. Well, that's all I'm going to state from this review. And these are new items on this channel. I love picking up these new and packaged items. So a lot of this stuff I do is new. And old figures alike. If you like this video, make sure to like, make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. This is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out, YouTube land.